Hello friends, welcome or welcome back to my channel. For those of you who are new, my name is Michaela and I make adult coloring videos here on this channel. And today I am doing my October 2021 coloring book haul. I have accumulated way too many books once again. I don't even know how this happened because I wasn't planning on getting majority of these. <laughs> um, but it kind of happened and I'm kind of thinking and I'm probably going to do this in the month of November doing a no buy with specific like like exceptions um but that'll be more in my November plans video coming next week so stay tuned for that but today I'm just going to go through all of the coloring books that I purchased this month um either I purchased it or it was sent to me for review um, I really hope you guys enjoy the video and let's get right on into it. So if you guys are interested in seeing um, a little bit of happy mail from Meg, Meg's Art Atrium, just stay to the end of the video. That's when I'll include it. But if you're not interested, I'm going to show the books first. Um, first off, we have Autumn Patterns Black Background by Color Questopia. I've already done, I think, three or four pages in this book. And it is like so stunning. The artwork is gorgeous and I have really just been enjoying coloring out of this book this month. Like I said, I've already done four pages, which to me is a lot, um, especially out of one book. Um, and I believe this is the only Color Questopia book I got this month, I think. For some reason, I don't think they came out with that many this month. I'm trying to think. I feel like there might have been another one that came out as well, but I don't know. I got uh, this book this month. Like I said, this is in a very weird order. This is, I don't even know why certain books are where they are in this list. But next we have Hiver, and this is by um, Hatchet Heroes, and it is one of their big mystery color by number books. I just did a full flip and review of the new books I got, um, but basically I'm just going to flip to the solutions, give you guys a little bit of a quick glance at that but basically these are just um mystery color by numbers and you basically just have a bunch of squiggly lines um that look like this and a color chart and basically you just color according to the chart and i have yet to do a page in hiver um, but it definitely is in the plans to get one or two or so many done in November because um, I've announced this on Instagram. Meg has announced it too. Um, but if you guys don't know, Meg and I are running a color along for the months of November and December. So November just till the end of the year. And it is hashtag enchanting Disney coloring 2021. I can't remember if it's enchanting or enchanted. But regardless... It'll be a really fun time, and I'm really excited for you guys to see that, and I will definitely have color and chats, probably, from more than one of these books, but I really definitely want to do one from Hiver. Next, we have the book that I was so excited to get, and it definitely does not disappoint. This is Mickey, Donald, and Co., and it's another one of the mystery books, and I love this one for the sole reason that I love Mickey Mouse. And I love his friends, and I just love, like, the overall Disney vibe of this book. It's great. This this book is really, truly a great time. I have already done one page in this book, um, but I will hold off on showing that until my end of the month. Finish pages flip, which I think should be coming... I want to say on Sunday is when that video is going up, but this was Mickey Donald and Co. Next we have Le Grand Classiques Tomb 3, also by Hatchet Heroes. Um, I placed a pretty big order on La Reca. Um, I think that's how you pronounce it. It is a new to the coloring community um, French Disney, well not French Disney website, but you can buy the French Disney books off of it. Um, so basically what I'm trying to say is it's a new website to us <laughs> and it just has like all the color by number books and I ordered some which is why I got like so many of them. I do not have a page done in this book either. The only book of these I have done one in was Mickey but again 
November, December for our color along because you guys, it's going to be such a good time. Um, that's when I'll get some pages done. I don't know why I'm, I'm flipping through this, but that is Le Grand Classique's Tomb 3. Next, we have one of my two small books I got. Um, the other one still hasn't arrived, so that'll probably be included in my end of the year haul video since I, I can't really show it, obviously, if it's not here. But what I do have here is Disney Buddies Color by Number, and basically this is just a pixel style book. Um, here are some of the solutions, but basically this book has just a bunch of pixels, and I have done a page in this book, if you guys watched my last video, which was, actually no, technically not my last video, my last video, no, this video is going up Thursday, my bad, I am, I don't know what's happening, um, my last video, which went up today, was my vlog. I did show you guys me and my progress of the picture in this book, but I am absolutely in love with this book. Um, so that is Disney Buddies. Next, we have the only Christmas book I got this month, which makes sense because it's not really Christmas time quite yet. It is All About Christmas by the Belba Family, and let me just show you guys my whip. <laughs> because shout out to me, because I already messed it up and I did not feel like continuing. I didn't realize that the alphabet restarted and like later you got in the key you were supposed to continue forward this way. I did some wrong colors here and it messed everything up so that's just a dead whip but basically this is the book. I mean I want to attempt another page in it, um, I just haven't gotten around to it yet. Next we have my big purchase of the month and that is Tales from the Forest Kingdom by Hannah Carlson. This book is absolutely stunning. It is Hannah's newest book to release in the United States and I actually have not shown this on my channel yet so I'm really happy that I finally get to show you guys. Um, but yeah, she has a new book out I feel like everywhere but here. Um, it's like Tales from the Witch's Cottage or something like that, um, but I love Hannah Carl's on. Even though I don't color in her books like as much as I want to, um, I still love collecting her books, especially because it's such a nice hardcover coloring book. I know these are books that'll last me like a lifetime, um, so I definitely knew I had to pick this book up. Next up, we have Pattern Animals Color by Colors by Kira Shershineva. Thank you so much, Kira, for sending me this book for review. I have been enjoying it a ton. I've done a couple pages in it this month already, but it is just another installment in her Color by Colors series. Cannot go wrong with that, I feel like. Pages are not super crazy, they don't take long to complete, and most importantly, they're fun. Also, I should have mentioned this earlier, but I'm sorry if I sound, like, really congested. Um, I feel like allergies are kicking in, which is odd because I don't have allergies, but, like, sometimes I feel like I do. I just have been sneezing a lot today, so I, I sound kind of congested, so I apologize. But that is Pattern Animals. Last, but certainly not least, we have 50 Halloween Miniatures by Camelia Angelkova, and I have done quite a few pages in this book and I actually have another buddy color planned out in this book with Meg and we are doing an Instagram live on Saturday. If you guys didn't know I've been saying it all over my Instagram. Meg has been saying it all over her Instagram and her channel. We are doing a live um, this Saturday at 7 p.m. so definitely show up <laughs> if you can and we'd love to see you there even if you could just pop in for a few minutes just to say hello. Um, or, you know, if you just want to pop in and lurk, totally fine too, um, but this is 50 Halloween Miniatures, and I have done quite a few in here, and actually, my friend, I was saying this, I believe in my, like, one of my color and chat videos, that, um, my friend has actually done a few pages in here too, I don't normally let people color out of my books, this is one of them that she did, um, but I trusted her to color in my book. <laughs> Here's another one that she did. I'll actually also show these at the end of the month too, even though they're not mine. Um, just kind of fun. But these were just some really hot, fun Halloween inspired pages and I really have enjoyed coloring in this book this month. So that is it for the actual haul part of this video. Um, if this is where you want to stop, 
totally go ahead. I really um, am thankful that you watched up to this point and I will catch you in my next video. But if you're interested in seeing what Meg got me, um, then please keep watching. So she sent me um, some really fun happy mail this month I was not expecting. And um, she started out by putting everything in this cute little bag. <laughs> I just felt the need to show this because it was cute. It was a little Halloween happy mail. Um, so first thing Meg got me is this cute little happy Halloween, um, like, little notebook thing. I've been resisting, like, using any of this stuff because I wanted to show you guys first before I, you know, dig into it. Um, but we have this cute little happy Halloween, um, notepad. She also got me, um, this little like sticker thing and she drew the owl and um and it's a sticker i don't know quite where i want to stick it yet but it's super cute she's so talented i love it so we have the sticker and the funniest thing in my opinion that came in this little package was this cute little um sticker of her dogs I, uh, she has said her dog's names to me multiple times i know one of them is named breezy and I can't think of the other one's name off the top of my head, but hopefully you guys can see this. Look how cute her dogs are. Um, I love it. I, 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 I love the sticker. I need to send her a sticker of Zeus now. And then last but certainly not least, well, she also got me a pen, but I'm not quite sure um, where my pen is. So she also got me a pen, but she also got me these cute little stickers and they're Wisconsin stickers. Look how freaking cute. Um, so has Wisconsin, we have the state, and then um, we have one with the United States and where Wisconsin is, um, home. I've seen that a lot in regards to Wisconsin. And then we'll have a barrel of fun. Oh, I love it. I love this gift so much. So thank you so much again, Meg. I know I've thanked you personally, um, but thank you so much again for this lovely gift. Um, it was really a fun little treat um, to get this month. But I think that's it for my video today. My voice is officially shot. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed it, make sure to give it a thumbs up. Hit that subscribe button down below and I will catch you guys in my next video. Bye guys!